What's up? This is Latif, the truth speaker. Oh, that's that you know can do. The black and Puerto Rican lyric be speaking the truth. It's trackademics. Forgive me when you mess with trackademics. If you say you want to get it, better know you got to live. What's up? It's DJ D Sharp. Right now, you're tuned in to LBTV. Yes, sir. I first heard Everywhere at Once in my car. Uh, LB burned me a copy, and I put it in the car, and I rode back, and I listened to the whole thing right then. Um, and I liked it. I liked the way I thought it was a good representation of kind of like his eclectic, uh, eclectic tastes, and yet his... Um, the way that LB really likes and lives for the funk. <laughs> he definitely has a clear vision of what what he feels his album should sound like. And uh, it's really important for his brand. And so it's definitely been cool working with him. Man, I really like Differences, man. Like, that's my joint. That's my joint. I love that song, man. That that song, everything about it, it, it got like this old school feel to me. You know, it's, it's like... It, it reminds me of like the '80s when I was a when I was a, when I was an '80s baby, you know what I'm saying? When I was listening to KSOL, he's very meticulous with everything he does, and and I think that's super important because he has a great project. The sound of it, everything, it's like very pinpointed uh, to what to what his brand is, to kind of what his fans expect from him, but then also uh, pick, uh, pushing boundaries, and so that's kind of what I like. Um, seeing all those different dynamics work. It's something that nobody else is really doing right now. I think that uh, LB is real kind of funk lean, very Bay Area funk lean. It's something that just everybody's kind of doing rock or they're trying to do electro pop or something like that. And this stuff is just kind of straight funk. I like Top Shelf a lot too. That's one of my favorite ones. I mean, the album in general is, is just, it's a dope album. It's a good, it's a good album. And my man's come a long way, you know what I'm saying, from from where he, from where, you know, from uh, later that day to now, you know what I'm saying, and you could you could see the progression, you know what I'm saying, like I could I could I could really say that this is his best record, you know what I'm saying, like so far. I definitely like I like it, I love it. That's one of my one of my ones because it's that um, that old school uh, mob mob sound that he that he's kind of coined for that uh, for that. Uh, Brings you back to kind of like uh, the lyric sound a little bit. Some of the ones I liked, I liked because they were a little different. Um, well, I'll, I'll start with Whisper because I thought that that song, when I first heard it, it was so personal. And like knowing them, obviously, I know how personal that was. And then to write about the experience, um, I just thought it was something. As soon as I heard it, I was like, oh, man, his fans are going to love this because this is going to make them feel like they know him because you feel like you know him. It's, and it's kind of unusual to hear somebody be that emotionally raw and kind of accessible in today's day and age of music, just that directly. Everywhere at once. That's the album. Make sure you get it. If you don't have it, go cop it. My man Lyrics Borns, man, that's his like second studio album, but... It, it seems like it's his like seventh album because the man keeps working. You know what I'm saying? He got the mixtapes, he got the live joint, he got uh, what else he got, man? Oh, the remix album. I mean, the dude stay working, man. So, yo, cop this second studio album everywhere at once. It's real hot. Go buy the album. That's what I will say. Go buy the album. It's 2008, and he definitely lyrics born is definitely doing it big. Check it out. Go pick up everywhere at once right now don't download it for free don't steal it oh you can steal it because then you know store pays for that but don't download if you download it for free then, and you like it go buy it but go cop it it's out now get that it's good music very very good food for the soul gotta have that work And the cover art is sick. The cover art is sick. Big shout out to Brent Rollins, hooking it up again. Tight. The cover art is clean. I like that a lot. 